Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 554. What is chronic bronchitis? Chronic bronchitis is a chronic inflammation of the bronchi, which is the medium-sized airway of the lung. It is generally considered to be one of the two forms of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or COPD, and the other being emphysema. Describe what happens to the bronchi in chronic bronchitis. In chronic bronchitis, there is hypertrophy of mucus secreting glands in the bronchi, which would lead to an increased mucus production as well as inflammation. So this is basically why there is obstruction in the airway. Also, one thing to mention here is that the reed index would be greater than 50%. And this reed index is what measures the thickness of the gland layer over the total thickness of the bronchial wall. What clinical findings are observed with chronic bronchitis? In chronic bronchitis, there is productive cough for more than 3 months per year for 2 years. You would also observe wheezing, crackle, cyanosis, which is the blueness, and this happens due to early onset hypoxemia, due to shunting, late onset dyspnea, and signs of right-sided heart failure. And this is what's going to give them that bloated presentation. What is the mnemonic to help you remember chronic bronchitis? The mnemonic to help you remember chronic bronchitis, just remember blue bloater. These patients will appear blue and bloated. The reason they're blue is because of the cyanosis and bloated because of signs of right heart failure. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.